Hey guys, Kyle Dimmon here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota. And today we're coming back to you with an R pod. It's a 171 Forest River. We'll get you on the outside, we'll get you inside, we'll see what you think. Alright, we're trying to beat the rain today with a brand new 2022 R pod 171 that just came in. Nice little teardrop trailer. So we'll get you around the outside, we'll get you inside, we'll see what you think. Couple new couple new graphics this year. Nice prod, the honeybee, and that honeycomb look logo on the outside. Start you up front. You got a quick connect for um, the gas. Hook up a grill. You got one, one 20 pound LP tank on board that we're gonna fill for you. Power tongue jack. Also, you're gonna have a battery. We have a battery box that we're gonna put it in the deal too. It's gonna live right there. Um, your battery disconnect right up front as well. Crank down jacks, trick of the trade, bring a little uh, three quarter inch bit on a, with a drill and blast those down. A little spot for your sewer hose right down here as well. Water connections out back, cable and power connections out back. Single axle. So nice, cool graphics. Storage door out back here that'll get you under the bed. It has a pass through so you can get through the other side. Coming with a spare tire on here as well on the back. Yep. It's a sharp looking unit. You don't get an on and on this one. It's a little tight and small, but that's all right. We do have outdoor speakers. Here's the other side of the pass through storage. Nice lightweight unit here, 2,700 pounds. Got Asdell in the wall. Nice little grab handle, a couple steps to bring you in. The door is on a friction hinge door. You can kind of point out the nice tempered glass front door, the new look for this year as well. Our pods give you a dog bowl trays they come with it nice spot for them there you can bring a cat with you too if that's what you got nice little dinette up front that will drop down into a bed so in a smaller trailer like this you can sleep you know two adults and two smaller kids up here or one adult up here and two in the back so really nice i really like this new front window as well and with that one we'll kind of show you here you got you know daytime shades and then you do have the nighttime shade as well. Really nice feature. And then something small like this, you got windows all around, really makes it feel nice and open. You do have the screen door, so you can leave it open. Cabinets up above. You are wired for solar. Radio. Two burner cooktop here with a nice glass top to make this countertop seem a little bigger and a big one basin farm style sink a little circular one um, and then almost like a drying rack with the slits in here which is really cool convection microwave and you do have an onboard vacuum so you have a spot if you want to hook up a hose otherwise down here you just kick it up with your foot and it'll just suck it in like a nice little dust buster that's really cool you do have a bathroom in here. It is a wet bath, which means you have your toilet and your shower is all in one little sink in there. You do have a fan up top, but you know, it is a little smaller, but you do get everything all in one in a nice small trailer like this, which is really nice, convenient. And then you do have these little sections here if you want to get a dowel, put it across and almost turn this into a wardrobe space as well. AC unit right up above me here and then you do have a good size fridge in here most of these are a little dorm fridge but this one's a good size fridge got a little freezer in here countertop space if you wanted to put a TV or something up here otherwise you know maybe pop a toaster up here nice little section 
Um, you do have the appropriate power, a little GFCI right here. Box full of goodies, cutting board, your power cables, everything is in here. Windows all around in the bedroom as well. So you don't feel that claustrophobic feel in something small like this. They do give you a lot of windows, make it feel really open. Another outlet back in the corner here as well. Also another little hanger, a little clothes hanger here. Kind of conveniently stows away on the wall when you're not using it, or if you want to hang some clothes, dry some stuff out. Really nice spot there. So like I said, an R-Pod 171, really nice smaller trailer you know for the folks that just have the little SUV you know smaller spot to store it or if mainly you're just looking to get up off the ground out of a tent and just into something that has the hard walls um, but yet yeah, still small to get you into any of those campsites um, this is a great option for you guys miss the storage down there but yeah just a great little unit just came in 2022 still some good camping left this year so there you have it my name is kyle i'm here at bullion rv in duluth minnesota if you have any questions about anything we have here especially this rpod 171 please feel free to reach out at 320-290-5834 happy to answer any questions you have you can also shoot me a text at that number as well get out get some camping in before the season's over can't wait to talk to you